Send me your submissions, I'll rate your gameplay. If you take a bison, you get F's all day. I really want to rate gameplay with you. Please like and subscribe for your boy. Subscribe for your boy. Yeah! Hello friends and welcome to the week of the Maximum Rever. What that means is people who have joined my membership, link below. They are the maximum, the highest level, which means they get to skip the queue. We got a full week of them coming up. This one comes from Andy Nomis. Remember the dude who was the first one to do the zero of a kind? The great one, like he literally entered the battlefield with no pets and won. Andy Nomis was the first to do it. He is a legend of not only this channel, but the SAP community. And he's a good dude. And here's what he said. This one came from the 24th of April, I believe. Hello, Reverend Grand Twitcher. <laughs> I love that you posted a video from another game the other day because I actually believe you have what it takes to be a variety streamer. You're one of my favorite streamers and I watch a lot of them. Your personality and charisma is perfect for it and the only things that hold you back is time, I guess, and sap, not the game itself, but the small audience. And if you don't go for it, you could make it in the music industry. That's so cool, man. Andy, I appreciate you. I uh, definitely plan to like broaden out a bit, but... Uh, this just isn't the time, dude, and I still love SAP a lot, a lot, a lot. But I will, I look forward to doing that in the future. Thank you. Anyway, don't expect this run to be anything revolutionary. Just a fun run I had while trying for Unicorn Pack achievements. And as you know, I almost only play weeklies to give myself a little more of a challenge when going for them. And sometimes you just get a good idea for a, a run at the same time. I hope you enjoy Andy numbers. Andy, I'm happy you're back in the submissions queue. Let's jump in. This was the weekly that was happening at that time, I guess. I remember seeing people making Anubis Hedgehog builds, but I don't think I played this one, like not a single game. Perhaps, so he's hunting for an achievement. We don't know which one. I might just move myself off to the side a little bit more so I'm next to the mascot. Hello, we're on that. You, you know what this screen looks like? You know when you get to the cinemas and you're watching all like the previews for the other movies and then your movie begins and the screen goes like this and you're like, oh, it's game time, dude. That's kind of what it feels, <clears throat> feels like right now, excuse me. So Andy Nomis, by the way, is secretly busted at this game. And he's mentioned, he's mentioned, we might be seeing him in the dojo in competitive sap as of next year. Uh, and look, I see no reason why someone who's a good arena player, you just need to like get rid of some habits and you can kind of pop off. Pop off not in the sense of fart, you know, like sometimes you hear a fart. Uh, I guess like it, calling it a pop off is it's like a uh, it's like a, a polite way of saying fart. But can you ever make flatulence polite? You've hit double cappy. All right, you're gonna be weak this round, strong the next round. Yes, 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 yes. In fact, you're gonna be strong enough this round to take a draw. That's huge. So I wonder what you're targeting. Did his screen at the start have achievements? That's a big drop there, dude. That's a big hedgehog, dude. And you're gonna cook him. Wait, maybe we're seeing a Nubus hedgehog from, from Andy. Maybe, just maybe. I wouldn't say running a Nubus hedgehog would ever be the call in competi <laughs> competitive. But he's not playing competitive, dude. He's having fun. Not that you can't play competitive, but you know what I mean. Relax, buddy. It's a draw. God, this is going to be a deep cut. I don't know if many of you will get this, but this mascot... Who remembers Echo Sticks Charlie's episode where he, he said congrats for Stephanie for making Pearl? And he was talking about a notification that was about to pop up on the screen. But I hadn't seen that yet, and I thought this was Stephanie making Pearls? Uh, I can't see this mascot and not think about Stephanie making Pearl. And do you know the crazy thing? Stephanie probably never knows it. And if she... How would she know? How would she know that? Rev! Use your brain! Big drop bear, big wins. Stay on... Stay, stay focused, man. I think I would be the best competitive sap commentator in the world. Half of the time. Oh my god. This chair is broken. If you know, you know. Um, let me explain. 
as your food dog is kind of like sitting on your capybara, and now it's off. I mean, based on the position and the capybara, it's it looked like something else actually, if I'm being honest. Uh, I think I would be the best competitive commentator. I think I would bring the proper hype to the game. I think I would bring adequate analysis for the most part, but then you know what I think would happen? I think I would get extremely distracted, like, and potentially miss out on key things happening. And my co-commentator would keep going to jump in and say stuff. And I'd be like, you just wonder what was going through Franz Ferdinand's brain? He had to have seen that he was going to, you know? And then my co-commentator's like, um, okay, he's cycling uh, the zebra here, and gee, on one health you'd want to... And I'd just be like, it's kind of selfish, actually. <laughs> okay, we're seagulling? Now, surely it's not a giraffe achievement, although you have, you've hit the, you've hit the giraffe lottery. What do they call a group of giraffes? I know this. I know this. I really do. Um, it's a caravan of camels. It's a tower of giraffes. It's a tower of giraffes. You had the tower. Now you have a singular building. Also known as a giraffe. Now, what do you... I don't know. I can't remember the, the food that was at the start. So I didn't even consider the, the, the seagull world we could be living in. You lose here. But we don't care about Jeff. Jeff J Jeff Johns. I don't think you care about this hippo either, is my prediction. I don't think it's part of your dreams. You going for that guy? Uh, the, uh... Oh, God. My pronunciation, my brain gets stuck. Leviathan? Or Levithian? No, it has to be Leviathan. Wait, can we talk about this real quick while Seth, while Swift sets up his team? In uh, episode 112 of Rate My Gameplay, I was talking about how... Oh, I see what you're going to do. The, the fish will get rice, which will swappy, 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 and you'll get extra gold. I see it. It's genius. I love it. Good math. Melon me. Kind of rude. Unlucky. In episode 112, I was talking about the uh, Cerebrus. And I basically, like, my memory failed me, and I've essentially gaslit my whole audience. And I want you all to know that I don't feel good about it. I really don't. I, uh... I was the one calling it Cerebrus as a child, and then people corrected me saying it's Cerebrus. No, 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 no. God, I'm getting it all wrong. Cerberus. <laughs> it's pronounced Cerberus, and I was calling it Cerebrus, but when I told the story, I was saying that I was the one calling it Cerberus, and other people were calling it Cerebrus. So everyone's in the comments today, at the, the day of me recording, telling me that I was correct. And that it actually is pronounced Cerberus. When in actuality, I was the one calling it Cerebrus. This is why I'd be the best and the worst commentator of all time. I just missed three rounds. Okay, fishy, 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 fishy. Um, Andy, you deserve better than this. Can we get a level? So, I... The... The, the Levithian... Nah, oh God, how do you... Just shut up, alright? I'm gonna Google it. How to pronounce... Leviath... Leviathan. What about let's do it slow? Leviathan. 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 See, I was right. Chip. Chips were. Oh, Dragon would kind of pop off with this, no? Actually, it wouldn't, because it'd only be buffing one unit, not required. <sighs> Do 
tomato on the seagull would be pretty funny. Are you gonna save that to the end? And are you gonna, what, how are you gonna, how are you winning? <laughs> uh, good math. I guess, you know, you do have three 30, 30 units at the back. That's always a good thing. Um, I, I feel like my commentary is tough to recover from today. Okay, now you're going to Tomato Town. Because I guess now you're going to keep... You're going to keep the future fishies. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Say it with me. Fishy, 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 fishy. Oh, you're cooking. Yeah, why not? Gold efficient drink me liquid. That's a new sentence. Melon, 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 melon. Uh, was melon even in the pack? I doubt it was. Oh, so your team's mega cracked. Wait. Scary team. You still win? Okay, yeah, you're cracked. And you're cracked. You're cracked. You you have a you have a very grounded sap approach to the game. I guess that makes sense, right? Because you're getting two more anyway, so why not? Yep. Two fish... <laughs> two flying fish go off into the distance. And now let's see. Good math. Ah, oh, yeah, you just win. I mean, this is a cute team you got here. Nedja? Hedja? Nedja? Wedja? Nedja, it says. Back your, back your instincts, Rev. And you win. Andy Nomis, you said not to expect much. I just don't believe you. Like, you submit and you cook. And that's what you do. Tactics. I'm going an A. I just am. You knew the pack. You knew what you wanted. You cooked. Creativity is also an A. Dominance, you are way better. That's an A. It, it, it's a, it's it, As per usual, it's an A for Andy Nomis overall. It's an A for Andy Nomis. And I think you are a, uh, like, you've contributed what I believe to be the best run in SAP history. But also, every submission you make is good. You're a positive influence in streams and the comment section. The SAP community is lucky to have you. Show some love to my guy, Andy, down below. Next up will be... Mirko. So it's a lot of people that I'm very fond of. Uh, and thanks again to uh, Mr. Andy Nomis. Goodbye, people.